It's my great pleasure to meet with another person from the Western States. This is Sri Nayak. She's from the University of Arizona. Uh, and she's going to tell us about her amazing project. So please tell us. Okay. Thank you so much. Sure. So essentially, this project was about teaching people in resource poor environments how to do basic CPR. And I don't know if many of you all know, but now CPR has gone from being something that involves uh, breathing and compressions to just compressions. And after I learned about it, the question I was struck by why is why don't people everywhere know about this? Um, the actual inspiration behind this project is I went to India and in a lot of really resource poor environments in India we have a lot of kids dying from cardiac arrest and no one knows how to save them. So um, the other thing I noticed in those areas is they might not have running water but they have smartphones, hence the inspiration for this project. So our goal was to take a basic smartphone that we might be able to find in resource poor environments, so usually an Android phone that's a couple generations old and put technology or an app on there that tests how uh, deep your compressions are and how fast you're doing the compressions. You tested it and you yeah. found that people actually were way better at doing CPR yeah, than so they otherwise would be, right? Yes, so the data that we got after doing the pre and post questions is that almost ev on every single scale, so for example, how deep are they, are they doing the compressions accurately, are they uh -huh. uh, doing it on time? Um, their overall confidence, their willingness to form CPR on uh, people that might be having cardiac arrest and overall content knowledge was significantly increased. So, and I thought that was amazing. I was not expecting that the first time around. Oh, that's great. With yeah. all of them, I think our odds ratio was above 30 at the least. Mm -hmm. Some oh, of them, they were almost 50. So. so for lay people, that's a huge difference in mm -hmm. terms of having the confidence and the interest uh, and maybe the ability just to do CPR. Um, and these are untrained people, mm -hmm. and now you're offering them basically online training mm -hmm. if they ever need it. Yeah, exactly. Yeah.